Well, hello again, everyone. My name is Chronos006, back with another new experience for you. This is the latest creation of Kotaru Chikoshi of 999 Zero Escape, Virtue's Last Reward, and Zero Time Dilemma, Kotaro Uchikoshi. Spike Chunsoft, you know I love these games, you know you guys love these games, we're about to do the newest one. This just came out maybe two weeks ago, I just, I wanted to make sure the reviews were good. This is, as far as I can tell, a murder mystery sort of thing, and I know we are in the uh, month of October, time for some spooky scary shit. I'm hoping this will work, I'm doing the webcam because I'm hoping this game will be a little creepy. But first, let's look at some options. Oh, that's right, I already... <laughs> I did play this a little bit. I wanted to make sure that uh, it would work, and it is. So here we go. We're gonna do a new game. Yep. I've been looking forward to this one for a while. I believe I'm looking at a carousel. It seems to be raining heavily. Oh dear! Deadly premonition, anyone? Kinda feels like that. You're missing an eye. Well. Strap in, guys. This is going to be a weird and interesting one. I have a... I have a feeling. Day one, Friday. SIG AI. Bloom Park, Friday, 10.54 p.m. <laughs> Welcome to Bloom Park. Where's Nam and Jaden? FBI. Yeah, she doesn't seem to be having a good time. Investigation. During investigations, the main character, Date, inspects scenes and collects testimony. Progress by examining objects and talking to people. Sounds good. What in the fuck is that? It's like a little teddy bear, except all it is is an eye. Dante's position is fixed, but you can move the cursor and your view. Try looking around and move the cursor to find... Boy, he's, uh... He or she is having a ball right now. Moving the cursor to find something catches your eye and inspect it. How about the fence? There's a fence set up around the merry-go-round. Probably to prevent nosy kids from getting caught in the machinery. Boss! 
Choices and look. When you speak to a person, you'll be presented with choices and look. Ah, shit. Sorry. Look will allow you to observe the person you're speaking to. Okay, so I have choices here as to what to say or do. Cool. Well, boss. So, what am I doing here? Are you serious? Yes. Deadly serious. Whoa, he has heterochromia. You're Special Agent Kaname Date. You're a member of Abyss, and that means you answer to me. Uh, Abyss. I called you here to inspect the scene, Date. Sure, boss. But inspecting dead bodies isn't usually part of the job. Usually, no. But tonight it is. Because you know this woman, don't you, Date? Do I? I had to tell you. You deserve to know. <laughs> this rain is awful, huh? It's unusual for this time of year. It'll be hard to find any usable prints. Who found the body? Metro got a call about two hours ago. Someone heard screaming coming from the park. Beat cop responded, checked out the scene. You found the corpse. Yeah. Thing is, the caller was anonymous. Of course. I'll give you the details later. Conversations. After finishing discussing a topic with someone, they might have new things to talk about. No kidding! That's kind of how that works. When talking to people, choose topics that interest you. You might obtain important information or clues. Log. Yeah, nobody cares about that. Um, I call her boss. She runs Abyss, a special branch of the Metropolitan Police Department. I report directly to her. I assume we're in Tokyo. Any suspects? Not yet. We just found the victim. Too early to say anything for sure, but this could be a copycat killer at work. Wait, what? From the case six years ago. Six years ago? The case six years ago? For whatever reason, she didn't elaborate. A case six years ago. What can you tell me about voodoo? I mean the victim. Her name's Nadami Shoko. You knew her, right? Did I? That's the second time you've said that. What was the relationship like? I heard you two have been close for years. I wouldn't say that. We were just acquaintances. Hmm. Right now, she's standing in the pouring rain with her umbrella up. Yes, thank you. Okay, so I can, I can look all over the place with my right controller stick. A red barrier line wraps around the scene. In the old days, they used to use yellow caution tape for this. Now we've got cheap hologram technology that could do the job even better. Nice. Well, sometimes we use good old-fashioned yellow tape. This rain is depressing. Has it been like this all day? Says you. I like a good rain. The old ferris wheel is over there. It feels like an enormous eye staring down at you. I have been on the eye in London. It was very fun. Panda ride. Panda ride looks lonely. Aww. What's up? Is that anything? Bench. It's a bench. Thank you, Date. Whoa. Skewered horse. A horse from the merry-go-round. It looks like it's skewered. This is not a message from the criminal. Ah! The park was already in this state before the crime. Hi, Iba. Iba eyeball. <laughs> nice. My best hypothesis is that this is the result of a teenage prank. So you say. Is this the control room? The place where the operator sits to turn the ride on and off. I took a look inside, but I didn't see anything that might be a clue. Alright. Column. It's the main column holding up the roof. Roof. It's been eight years since Bloom Park closed. The weather's gotten to it pretty bad. Okay, so... The park closed eight years ago. 
but the boss implied that there was a murder six years ago. Hmm. History seems to be repeating itself. Jeez, these skewered horses are everywhere. Let's talk to these guys. Policeman. How's the investigation coming? Not too good, unfortunately. We're not finding much. He sounds like a New Yorker. A local cop. A local cop. How about you, Inspector? An inspector from Metro. I hope he finds a lead. Thanks for coming out here in this mess. It's my duty, sir, but thank you. Well, anything to go on? Not yet, sir. Wow, you are not helpful in the least. What's your name? Wow, I, I never thought a great detective like you would ask me my name. It's Kagami, sir. It's Kagami, sir. Kagami. Are you serious? It's Kagami! <laughs> Alright. Fine. Sorry. He's inspecting the scene now. It's a horse from the merry-go-round. Thank you. So helpful. Alright. Is there anything I haven't seen here? Oh. Well, I haven't actually looked at the body. It's a metal pole. And here's the corpse. The body is mounted... Ooh, on one of the horses. I should get a better look. I took a step forward. Ah, sorry, sir. Could you please not get any closer? What was your name again? <laughs> we haven't taken any footprints yet. I appreciate your understanding. <laughs> Allow me to assist you. That's Iba. Her official designate. Wow. Her official designation is AI Ball. Aiba. Get it? <laughs> She's an artificial intelligence bent, built into my fake eye? That's the LOI. Okay. An AI for an eye. <laughs> you want me to use the zoom, right? Yep. Right there. His left eye is yellow. Correct. That will allow you to investigate without physically disturbing the scene. Iba's vision modes. While playing through the story, Iba's special vision modes may help you obtain new info. You can now use the zoom mode to enlarge the target. Select zoom and examine the corpse. You can also view the controls in dots. Cool. Oh wait, I have to... There it is. Whoa, that's cool. Pupil dilation and corneal turbidity indicate the victim is dead. Thanks. Couldn't tell that. The eye of a dead woman. I am detecting signs of increased stress in your body. Cortisol and ACTH concentration is rising. So he did know this person. Don't bug me with jargon right now, alright? I'm just... upset. Yeah, he knew this person. I knew her. I know. Remember that I also saw her several times. Though it has been quite some time since we last saw her. The left eye socket is vacant. Victim has had her left eyeball removed. Her left eye? The most likely scenario is that the killer or killers removed it. Well, we don't know that for sure. A crow or some other animal could have pulled it off the corpse. I suppose that's true. But that wouldn't make for good drama. Impossible. Oh? 
The amount of blood indicates that the victim's eye was removed before her death. Oh, good point. They carved it out while she was still alive? Correct. Mm. Yikes. Multiple puncture wounds to the front of the torso. Cause of death? Blood loss from these wounds. Body temperature and rigor mortis indicate the time of death was approximately six hours ago. Time was at 10.54, so that would make it around 4.30. That would place the crime occurring around 5, 5. p.m. Several puncture wounds, but no cuts or tears. That means... The victim is probably stabbed with something pointed and smooth, like an ice pick. Excuse me? Analyzing the source of the sound. Sonic analysis indicates the sound originated from inside the merry-go-round central column. Inside the column? The noise came from inside. Date, use me to see through the column. Sure. Utilize the x-ray mode. X-ray mode? Oh my. How do I do that? Oh, that's not right. The menu contains a number of functions such as file, flowchart, options, and guide. The game will auto save, but you can also save manually. Cool. In the game, whatever. Alright, what we got here? Flowchart. We got options, we got save. Let's save. Sure. I remember that sound effect. <laughs> Do you? Case notes. File as you read information about people you've spoken to, blah, blah, blah. Well, that's cool. I'm not going to look at it right now. Because I want to see what's going on here. Uh, how do I do this? God damn it. There we go. Wow. Oh, there's somebody in there. Oh, no. It appears as though someone is inside. I threw down my umbrella and ran to the pillar. Hey, wait! Shut up. What was your name again? I pushed him aside and ran up on the platform. Hey, I know you're in there. If you can hear me, say something. No reply at all. No reply at all. Looking closely, I found a small handle on the column. I grabbed it hard and tried to pull it open. I know that sound effect too. <laughs> Love it. It may be locked from the inside. Damn it. Hey, whoever's in there, stay back. Whoa, that's quite the gun. Hi. And a nice pick. Mizuki. Mizuki? Who the freak is Mizuki? Hmm. Seems a little too easy, doesn't it? Whoa! Ah! I thought that was gonna be an intro sequence. I was wrong. What is this place? This is your dream. Okay. I'm... me. Correct. You are Date. Thanks. And you are? <gasps> oh! You're... Okay. Ah! 
Fucking skeletons! Stop it with the skeletons, games! Where do I even start with this? I can answer all of your queries. I'm sure you can. All right, then. 